I knew how to run a practice and do a warm up and I did very little track and stuff when I was in high school so I'm like, I'm not the perfect athlete so I want to be able to make them better athletes. So I actually worked with Scott two summers ago. He came and conditioned my cheerleaders and they loved it. Um, and because of quarantine, we didn't get a chance to do it this year but I was like, what of these tips could I use in a daily practice with them to make them stronger and make them better? They love to go straight to stunting but they don't have the strength to get through it so they get tired very easily and then we end up ending practices earlier. So learning different strength routines to help them build up their endurance, giving them better conditioning practices as the warm-ups are a little bit stronger. Um, just it, in the long run, it's going to help them, especially because our seasons are so long. Parkview has always been really good with us when it comes to performance ideas and tips. Um, they're constantly sending stuff to us to say, hey, we have this training program. So I was like, hey, I'm jumping on board with that. I definitely need that for my kids and help them grow and get better. I came here today to kind of get a refresh on how to approach the high school athlete. Uh, strength conditioning is something I've done in the past. Just want to see if there's any new things, any new trends, how to cycle the kids through in season, out of season, uh, preseason, and then just the approach on how to work with the uh, athletes when it comes to speed and mobility. My approach with this is to help develop the kids and get them ready for the next level and to get the best and the most out of the kid, not the athlete. I think this is a great opportunity for the athletes as well as the coaches that are involved. Just bringing the community together, uh, passing on knowledge, uh, just to bring the best out of each student at uh, every high school here in Fort Wayne and playing a part with that.